Hey guys, today we're discussing some basic information about the three most popular types of home solar panels, the polycrystalline panels, the monocrystalline panels, and the flexible panels. The monocrystalline panels and the polycrystalline panels, they share a lot of common factors. As far as the construction goes, they're very similar, they're both encased in a uh, aluminum casing. Uh, as far as the warranty goes, they're usually both offered at about a 25 year warranty. The major difference is the efficiency. The efficiency of the monocrystalline panels because it's one single cell, it's efficient at about 20%. Uh, that's 20% of the solar energy that is pulled in uh, is converted into electricity. Um, as far as the polycrystalline panel, which is you know many different pieces of the uh, panel crushed together, uh, they only do the uh, efficiency at about 17% of the solar power that comes in is converted into usable electricity. Um, as far as the flexible panels go, you know, they're a lot less uh, durable. They're not encased in any type of enclosure, which gives them their flexibility. But then they are susceptible to uh, scratches and even cracks. So uh, they aren't uh, offered at such a long warranty, only about 10 years. Their efficiency levels are much lower as well at only about 12% of the solar power that they pull in is converted into usable electricity. The major uh, benefit of the flexible panels is the weight. They, they're weighing in at about 10 pounds per 150 watts. Uh, the difference in the mono and poly, because of that large encasing, it's about uh, 25 pounds per 150 watts. Uh, as far as the cost goes, though, the flexible panel, as far as the cost per watt, the flexible panels are the most expensive, coming in at about $1 per watt. Um, the monocrystalline panels are about 60 cents per watt and the polycrystalline panels are about 50 cents per watt. When factoring that small price difference between the mono and polycrystalline panels, only about 10 cents per watt. Um, because of the efficiency levels, the monocrystalline panels right now are probably your best option as far as having a smaller footprint with a higher 20% efficiency rating versus the 17% efficiency rating. So that's been a basic look at the three most popular types of home solar panels. Uh, like and subscribe the video if you found this information uh, helpful. And if you need more information, contact us at powerinverters.com.